Welcome to the chemistry question. Jordan here, and today I would like to talk about indium. Indium is a group 3A or a group 13 post-transition metal, and it has some very unusual properties. To start, it has two naturally occurring isotopes, indium-113 and indium-115. Indium-115 by far is the most abundant, compromising over 95% of natural indium. But what's unusual is, while it's the most abundant, it is also slightly radioactive. Though its half-life is several orders of magnitude larger than the age of the universe, so it's pretty much practically non-radioactive. Now, indium is a very soft metal, and it can be cut with a knife. Also, it wets glass, meaning it sticks to glass rather than just being repelled by its surface. You can also alloy it with gallium and tin and make a liquid metal that's a substitute for mercury in thermometers. Thank you for watching the chemistry question. Be sure to subscribe and leave any questions or suggestions in the comments below. Until next time.